Enjoy our story. <laughs> Talks the big talk now, but Erica had a lot of problems back in the day. Remember that time she was hurt by a relationship and disappeared? Huh? huh? What happened? <laughs> I remember that. You know, people were saying she was dead, but then she just popped up out of nowhere. I never knew Erica had some trauma like that in her past, but I'll fill every hole in her heart. I'll fill every hole in her heart. Hey, I'm serious here. Don't make fun of me. Drink up, Vince. This is all the free time you get. Anyway, Catherine isn't cheating on you. Why are you even doubting her? I don't even know. You're ignoring your own sins in the first place. But... but... Then why don't you break up? Huh. Well, if you're cheating, and you think she's cheating, that's the logical choice. <sighs> Dude, don't just sit there getting angry. I'm not. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm just tired. My head hurts. Maybe I've been playing too much Rapunzel. Hey, I got the top score on that right now. Once I figured out the trick, I got pretty far. You guys really like that game. You don't get why it's so fun, eh, Toby boy? Hey, that's mean. After I got the hang of it, it's just so addictive. You're the kind of guy who won't give up till you beat it, huh? Oh, isn't everyone like that? Yeah. You took life one step at a time until you started dating Catherine, didn't you? Uh, shut up already. Sorry, I need to take a whiz. You talk mail. Hey, how's Toby doing at work? He's fine. I can trust him to customize a bike without watching over him. <laughs> you should spend more time tinkering with chicks, not bikes. He needs to hook up with somebody good for him. Someone besides Erica? You're so good with the little guy. How about sharing some of that love with us? Yeah, right. Lindsay, would you like to speak to Martha? Do you see yourself as a dog? Do you see yourself as a cat? This one? Do you know about ants? Ants? Like the bugs? I hear they're messengers of witches. 
They come out of the mouths of the men who wasted away to death. What? I thought that was just a rumor. It's three days until the time of freedom. What are you talking about? You got mail. Mr. Morgan and Mr. Todd don't get along well, but it was Mr. Todd who stopped Mr. Morgan from committing suicide. He was arrested for assaulting Mr. Morgan. He was demoted as a result. But what the two of them don't know, the two of them don't know that Mr. Daniel had him cleared of the charges. sleep last night three hours and yet you're still working non-stop take care of yourself Daniel I don't think I've introduced you folks yet Vincent this is Daniel and Anna <laughs> oh I'm sorry he seems to be a bit tired is he all right he says that he hasn't been able to sleep I keep telling him that his health is more important than his job is pretty important though I would say that too worried about me but I'm worried it's not because I'm busy at work don't stick your nose into this then that means you've been busy planning your wedding how sad oh you guys are getting married nope well, uh... duty early today because of the incident. The victims are all men who are younger than me. I feel so bad for those young guys. When someone like me is still alive, do you believe in an afterlife? Well? Oh, really? If there is an afterlife, that means that death isn't the end of everything. But I want there to be an end. I'm only living now because I have something I need to do. What's that? To find the criminal who shot my wife and killed. 
kill him with my own hands. My wife is dead, so he'll die. And then I'll die. That's when everything will finally disappear. Are you thinking of dying? Well, I'm certainly not good at living. Sorry, but I'm going home. I just came for a little drink before bed. Is this beer or water? I'm not even getting a buzz. Yesterday's story. Oh, sure. You're up for it. I think I was at the part where the ballerina suddenly had many enemies. She started to be harassed. Eventually, her entire family was killed. What? She took her own life after that. It's the truth. It's done, it's done. That's what everyone else says. But it still won't bring her back. Have I told you about that legend? That if you survive, you'll be granted any one wish. It's just a rumor, right? It might be a ridiculous fairy tale, but right now, I feel like I've got to believe in something if I'm going to go on. If I'd never written that article, she'd still be alive. I know what my wish would be. I'd change the past, save her. I was such a fool. But that's why I'm hung up on this stupid legend. Go ahead and laugh if you like. It's not funny. I'm gonna head home. Excuse me. Now, continuing our coverage of the mysterious weakening deaths. Richard Davis, age 30, has been found dead today. 30? Wow. It's even younger than I am. <sighs> That's all the updates we have on this story currently. After a commercial break, we'll bring you the weather. As always, if we have anything new to report, when it comes to choosing a partner, the way men see things can't compare to the way women view it. I hear they even distinguish by smell, too. I wonder. I thought I was a sweet-scented middle-aged man, but Eric had just said I have old man smell. Like I care. Yeah, anyway, as I was going to say, the hunter in relationships is actually the female. Female moose have males fight each other to win her courtship. When I saw that documentary last night, I was on the edge of tears for the poor husband. Maybe you can't be too careless for too long. Ah, uh, uh, it's late. Anyway, I have to set things straight tomorrow. Hey, Vincent, we're going home now. All right, I'll see you later. Maybe Orlando, too, but not Johnny. Not true. He said he told his girlfriend that he has no intention of marrying her. How can a man tell a woman that? It's like saying, I don't love you. If that happened to me, I'd disappear all over again. Oh, I remember that. You just up and vanished. Stop saying I vanished. I was crashing at a friend's place. I remember that you guys were all worried sick. Of course we were. We honestly thought you were dead. To be young and thoughtless can be forgiven. But if you're an adult... Stop tormenting yourself all over again. So you guys really need to learn how a girl's heart works. A girl is always hoping someone will come and sweep them away. I'd be more convinced if a woman was telling you this. Ahem, sounds like somebody wants to pay their tab right now. Women are hunting every day for better prey. If you take too long, you might be exchanged for the prey next to you, you know. 